Shillong, English, Kasi, Shillong is a hill station in the northeastern part of India and the capital of Meghalaya, which means, the abode of clouds, and is one of the smallest states in India. It is the headquarters of the East Kasi Hills District and is situated at an average altitude of 4,908 feet 1,496 meters above sea level, with the highest point being Shillong Peak at 6,449 feet 1,966 meters. Shillong is the 330th most populous city in India with a population of 143,229 according to the 2011 census. It is said that the rolling hills around the town reminded the European settlers of Scotland. Hence, they would also refer to it as the Scotland of the East. Shillong has steadily grown in size since it was made the civil station of the Khasi and Jainsha Hills in 1864 by the British. In 1874, on the formation of Assam as the chief commissioner's province, it was chosen as the headquarters of the new administration because of its convenient location between the Brahmaputra and Surma valleys and more so because the climate of Shillong was much cooler than tropical India. Shillong remained the capital of undivided Assam until the creation of the new state of Meghalaya on 21 January 1972, when Shillong became the capital of Meghalaya, and Assam moved its capital to Dispur in Guwahati. History Shillong was capital for composite Assam during the British regime and later till a separate state of Meghalaya was formed. David Scott, the British civil servant of the East India Company, was the agent of the Governor-General North East Frontier. During the First Anglo-Burmese War the British authorities felt the need for a road to connect Silhet and Assam. The route was to traverse across the Khasi and Jaintia Hills. David Scott overcame the difficulties his administration faced from the opposition of the Khasi Syiems, their chiefs and people. Impressed by the favourable cool climate of Khasi Hills, they negotiated with the Syiem of Sora in 1829 for a sanatorium for the British. Thus began the consolidation of British interests in the Khasi Jainsha Hills. A serious uprising by the Khasis against foreign occupation of their land followed. It began early in 1829 and continued till January 1833. Eventually, the Khasi Confederate chiefs were no match against the military might of the British. David Scott negotiated for the surrender of the leader of the Khasi resistance, Tarat Singh, who was then taken to Dhaka, present-day Dhaka, for detention. After the resistance of the Khasis, a political agent was posted in the hills, with its headquarters at Sora, also known by the name Cherupunji. But the climatic condition and facilities of Sora did not make the British happy, they then moved out to Shillong, which was then known as Yedo or Yuda, as the locals call it, for all we know maybe that's the correct spelling also as there was no script at the time as told by ASLO. The name, Shillong, was later adopted, as the location of the new town was below the Shillong Peak. In 1874, a separate chief commissionership was formed with Shillong as the seat of administration. The new administration included Silhet, now a part of Bangladesh. Also included in the chief commissionership were the Naga Hills present-day Nagaland, Lushai Hills present-day Mizoram as well as Khasi, Jainsha and Garo Hills. Shillong was the capital of composite Assam till 1969 when the autonomous state of Meghalaya was formed. In January 1972 Meghalaya was made a full-fledged state. The Shillong Municipal Board has a long history dating back to 1878, when a proclamation was issued constituting Shillong and its suburbs, including the villages of Makar and Laban, into a station under the Bengal Municipal Act of 1876. Inclusion of the villages of Makar S.E. Makar, Jao and part of Halupara and Mapram and Laban Lumparing, Maiden Laban, Kench's Trace and Rilbong within the municipality of Shillong was agreed to by Hain Manik Syiem of Milliam under the agreement of 15 November 1878. But, there is no trace of Shillong in the British era maps dating back to 1878, up to 1900. Shillong was also the subject of the Great Earthquake that occurred on 12 June 1897. The earthquake had an estimated moment magnitude of 8.1. 27 lives from Shillong town alone were lost. Geography <inaudible> 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 
Shillong is at 25.57 degrees north 91.88 degrees east, 25.57, 91.88. It lies on the Shillong Plateau, the only major uplifted structure in the northern Indian Shield. The city lies in the center of the plateau and is surrounded by hills, three of which are revered in Khasi tradition, Lum Sopetbanang, Lum Dingye and Lum Shillong. Location, Shillong, the capital city of Meghalaya is just 100 kilometers 62 miles from Guwahati which can be accessed by road along NH40, a journey of about 2 hours 30 minutes through lush green hills and the magnificent Umiam Lake in between. <laughs> Smart Cities Mission Shillong has been selected as the 100th city to receive funding under the center's flagship, Smart Cities Mission, Adil Mission for Rejuvenation and Urban Transformation AMRU. In January 2016, 20 cities were announced under the Smart Cities Mission, followed by 13 cities in May 2016, 27 cities in September 2016, 30 cities in June 2017, and 9 cities in January this year. The total proposed investment in the finally selected 100 cities under the Smart Cities mission would be 2 rupees 05018 crore. Under the scheme, each city will get 500 crore rupees from the center for implementing various projects. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Climate. Weather conditions in Shillong are typically pleasant, pollution-free. In the summer the temperature varies from 23 degrees Celsius 73 degrees Fahrenheit. In the winter the temperature varies from 4 degrees Celsius 39 degrees Fahrenheit. Under Köppen's climate classification the city features a subtropical highland climate CWB. Its summers are cool and very rainy, while its winters are cool and dry. Shillong is subject to vagaries of the monsoon. The monsoons arrive in June and it rains almost until the end of August. October to November and March to April are the best months to visit Shillong. Topic: Transport. Although well connected by road, Shillong has neither rail connections nor a proper air connection. Umroy Airport, located 30 kilometers (19 miles) from the city center, has only limited flights. Topic roadways Shillong is well connected by roads with all major northeastern states. Two major national highways pass through, National Highway 40 India connected to Guwahati National Highway 44 India connected to Tripura and Mizoram NH 44A private bus operators as well as state transport buses from other states ply to and from Shillong daily. Taxi services are also available to destination like Guwahati, Agartala, Damapur, Aizal and other northeastern towns and cities. The Shillong Bypass pictured is a two-lane road which stretches across 47.06 kilometers, 29.2 miles, connecting Umiam NH40 to Jorabad NH44, which then leads to other northeastern Indian states of Mizoram and Tripura. The project estimated to have cost around 220 crore rupees $31 million was completed in a span of two years 2011 to 2013. Topic. Airways Since 2017, there are daily flights between the city with Jorhat and Kolkata. Topic. Demographics As of 2011 India Census Shillong city population was 143,229 of which 49% are males, 51% females, 12% of the population was under 6 years of age. The average literacy rate was 93%, the male literacy rate being 95%, the female rate 91%. Christianity is the dominant religion in the city, practiced by 46% of the population, followed by Hinduism at 42%, Islam 5%, and to a lesser degree Sikhism, Buddhism, and Jainism. Shillong metropolitan region, which includes the towns of Latumkra, Lasotan, Madanarding, Maulai, Mopit, Nongsa, Nongminsong, Nongthimai, Pintharumkra, Shillong Canton. Atonement, Umlinka and Umpaling 
had a population of 354,759, 12% of the which being under 6 years of age. The literacy rate in the metro region was 91%. Kasis make up the majority of the population according to 2011 census. All the other northeast tribes such as Nagas, Garos, Pnars, Hajong people, Kukis, Manipuris, Lalungs, Karbis and Mizos etc. are represented here as well as significant numbers of Assamese, Bengalis, and a bit of Nepalis, Biharis, Marwaris, Punjabis and people from other Indian states making it a fairly cosmopolitan city. Nearly about 85% Khasi people are Christians. In Shillong Christmas is celebrated with great enthusiasm and fervor and it is the biggest festival of the city. Presbyterianism and other denominations of Protestants and Roman Catholics make up the Christian population. A large proportion of Khasi people that is 10% population still follow the original Khasi religion, Niam Khasi and Nyamtra and 3% Khasi people follow Hinduism and 2% Khasi people follow Islam. Places of interest Tourist sites in and around the city include Elephant Falls, 12 km on the outskirts of the city, the mountain stream descends through three successive falls set in dells of fern-covered rocks. Fan Nongle Park, the park stretches over a kilometer and has an adjacent mini-zoo. Wards Lake, known locally as Nan Palak. It is an artificial lake with garden and boating facilities. Shillong Golf Course. Shillong has one of the largest golf courses, the world's wettest in Asia, Glen Eagles of the East. It enjoys the rare distinction of being one of the few natural golf courses in Asia. Not only is the Shillong Golf Course scenic and enjoyable, it is also challenging. A group of British civil service officers introduced golf to Shillong in 1898 by constructing a nine-hole course. The present 18-hole course was inaugurated in 1924. The course is set in a valley covered with pine and rhododendron trees. The tight fairways, carpeted with a local grass which hardens the soil, are difficult to negotiate. The number of out-of-bounds streams that criss-cross every fairway makes it all the more trying. Obstructions come in the form of bunkers, trees and rain. The longest hole is the sixth, which is a grueling 594 yards. Shillong Golf Course is considered to be the Glen Eagle of the East at the United States Golf Association Museum. It was set in a valley at an altitude of 5,200 feet in 1898 as a nine-hole course and later converted into an 18-hole course in 1924 by Captain Jackson and C.K. Rhodes. Motfren, the Monument of France, which is locally known as Motfren, was erected in memory of the 26th Cossi Labour Corps who served under the British in France during World War I. It bears the words of the famous Latin poet Horace, Dulce et decorum est pro patria mori, which can be roughly translated as, It is sweet and honourable to die for one's country. Due to government neglect and public apathy, this monument is now in a dilapidated condition standing in one of the dirtiest localities of Shillong. Shillong Peak, a picnic spot, 10 km from the city, 1,966 meters above sea level, offers a panoramic view of the scenic countryside and is the highest point in the state. Obeisance is paid to Yu Shulong at the Sanctum Sanctorum at the peak summit every springtime, by the religious priest of Milliam State. Capt. Williamson Songma State Museum, for those interested in ethnic tribal culture and tradition this government museum offers insights to the lifestyle of the people. This museum is in the State Central Library complex where monuments for the great patriots of the state were erected besides the statue of SMT. Indira Gandhi and Nataji Subhash Chandra Bose. Don Bosco Center for Indigenous Cultures. The Don Bosco Museum is part of DBCIC, Don Bosco Center for Indigenous Cultures. DBCIC comprises research on cultures, publications, training, animation programs and the museum, which is a place of knowledge sharing on the cultures of the Northeast in particular, and of culture in general. DBCIC with its Don Bosco Museum is situated at Maulai, Shillong. Entomological Museum Butterfly Museum, a privately owned museum of M. S. Wanker, Riatsamthia, Shillong about 2 km from Police Bazaar is the only known museum in India devoted to moths and butterflies. Air Force Museum at Upper Shillong Forest Museum in Lady Hyderi Park Rhino Heritage Museum at Shillong 
Zoological Museum in Riza Colony Anthropological Museum at Mablai Botanical Museum at Fourth Furlong Arunachal Museum at the Cantonment Area Chrysalis the Gallery, this art gallery is on the second floor of Salonzer Mansion at Police Bazaar, the commercial hub of Shillong. Chrysalis has flexible spacing to display paintings, canvases, sculpture, photography and handicrafts. Run by a local artist, Jaya Kalra, the gallery caters to exhibitions of artists and artisans especially from the northeast and also from the rest of India. State Museum, located at the State Central Library Complex. Cathedral of Mary Help of Christians is in Don Bosco Square. Bishop and Beaton Falls, both cascade down the same escarpment into a deep valley. Spread Eagle Falls, 3 km from Polo Grounds. Sweet Falls, Sweet Falls also called Wydadam in the native dialect is the most beautiful of all the waterfalls in Shillong. It lies about 5 km from the Happy Valley and is about 96 meters in height. Crinolin Falls, near Phan Nonglay Park. Laitlam Canyon, the end of the hills. Sport Shillong is the only capital city in northeast India to produce two clubs that participate in the I-League, namely Royal Wangdo FC and Shillong Lajong FC. Both play at Jawaharlal Nehru Stadium. Royal Wangdo FC was adjudged second runners up in the 2014 15 season of I League. Shillong Golf Course is one of the oldest golf courses of the country and is surrounded by pine and rhododendron trees. Binning star Linkoy from Shillong is a national marathon runner and represented India in the last 2010 Commonwealth Games. He is the fastest marathoner in India with a timing of 2.18 hours. Education Autonomous institutions Indian Institute of Management National Institute of Technology Meghalaya National Institute of Fashion Technology, Shillong Northeastern Institute of Ayurveda and Homeopathy Topic B. Ed Colleges. College of Teacher Education (PGT). Street. Mary's College of Teacher Education. Topic General Degree Colleges. Basau College. Bormanik College. Buddha Banu Saraswati College. Goodwill College Greater Maulai College Iakantu College K. L. Bajoria College Lady Keen College Maulai Presbyterian College Morning Star College Nabon Women's Synod College Raid Laban College St. Anthony's College, Shillong St. Dominic's College St. Edmund's College Street Francis D. Assisi College, St. Mary's College, Sankardev College, Sang Kasi College, Shillong College, Shillong Commerce College, Synod College, Umsharpai College, Women's College, Shillong Law College Shillong Law College Topic: Medical College. Northeastern Indira Gandhi Regional Institute of Health and Medical Sciences. Topic: Nursing Colleges. Neigrihms College of Nursing. Woodland Institute of Nursing. Topic. Universities Topic Central Universities English and Foreign Languages University Northeastern Hill University NEHU 
Topic: Private Universities. CMJ University, Martin Luther Christian University, Techno Global University, University of Technology and Management (UTM), Shillong, William Carey University, Meghalaya. Topic: Media. Local media in Shillong is strong. There are a number of theaters, newspapers, magazines, local radio and television stations. Shillong is also often called as India's rock capital due to its inhabitants' great passion for music. Topic: <laughs> Cinema Cinemas in Shillong include Bijou Cinema Hall, Pyle Cinema, Gold Cinema and Anjali Cinema Hall also called Galleria Anjali Cinema. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Print Media. Newspapers are published for Shillong both in Khasi and English. Prominent English dailies published here include Shillong Times, Meghalaya Guardian, Highland Post, Meghalaya Times and The Sentinel. Kasi dailies like U Mafor, U Nongsan Hima among others are published here. Weekly newspaper are Salonzer and Dongmusa. There are magazines like Iing Kristen, celebrated 100 years of publication, Patang Minta in Kasi and Youth Today and Eastern Panorama in English. Electronic media The radio industry has expanded with a number of private and government-owned FM channels being introduced. State-owned Doordarshan transmits terrestrial television channels. Apart from these few weekly news channels like PCN, Re Kasi Channel, Batesi and T7 are broadcast weekly on the local cable networks. Communication services Fixed telephones lines are available. Internet services are available both wired and wireless broadband. It is also well covered in mobile networks with all major cellular providers like Airtel, Aircel, Vodafone, Idea, BSNL, Reliance, Geo are available here. Headquarters Eastern Air Command, Indian Air Force HQ Eastern Air Command HQ, EAC, was shifted to Shillong on 10 June 63 from Kolkata and housed in the old buildings located at Nonglier village at Upper Shillong, some 10 km from Lower Shillong, but at a greater altitude of around 6,000 feet AMSL. Initially a British military base, it was taken over by NO. 58 Gorkha Regiment of the Indian Army post-independence in 1947. The regiment was redeployed after the Sino-Indian War of 1962, making way for the IAF to step in. Only helicopters can operate from HQ, EAC, using a 12.7 hectare 31.3 acre helipad. EAC controls air operations in the eastern sector which include West Bengal, Assam, Mizoram and the other eastern states bordering Bangladesh, Burma and Tibet. EAC comprises permanent airbases at Shibua, Ghati, Bagdagra, Barakpur, Hashimara, Jorhat, Kalaikunda and Tezpur with forward airbases at Agartala, Kolkata, Panagar and Shillong. Neighborhoods Historic neighborhoods of Shillong include Makar, Jiao, Riatsamthia, Umsasun, Waingdo, Police Bazaar, Maulai, Latumkra, Laban, Malki, Nongthamai and Polo. Notable personalities associated with Shillong People who have been associated with Shillong include Amita Malik, film critic. Anyam Hassan is a Bangalore-based writer from Shillong. Her debut novel Lunatic in My Head, which is set in Shillong, was launched on 7 December 2007. She has also written a book of verse titled Street on the Hill. 
In Waradin Choudhury, a naturalist who is known as the Birdman of Assam was born and brought up in Shillong. He is the author of 22 books including The Birds of Assam and Pocket Guide to the Birds of Meghalaya. Arthur Llewellyn Basham, historian of Indian culture. He died in Kolkata in 1986 and is buried in Shillong. Arundhati Roy, writer and Booker Prize winner, was born in the KJP Synod Hospital in Shillong. Dr. APJ Abdul Kalam, former Indian president, and scientist while delivering a lecture at Indian Institute of Management Shillong on 27 July 2015, suffered a massive heart attack at around 6.30 p.m. East. He was rushed to the hospital in a critical condition and subsequently died of cardiac arrest. Edward Pritchard G., naturalist and author of The Wild Life of India spent his retired life in Evergreen Cottage in Upper Shillong. He left for England in 1968 and died soon after. Hanuman Prasad Potter, a great saint who was the founder editor of Kalyan magazine and Gita Press, born in Shillong on 17 September 1892. Indira Goswami, Goswami spent her early days in Shillong and studied at Pine Mount School. John Shepard Barron, inventor of the automated teller machine ATM, was born in Shillong. Karen David, a Canadian-British actress, singer and songwriter born in Shillong. She is best known for portraying Princess Isabella Maria Lucia Elisabetta of Valencia in ABC's fairy tale themed musical comedy television series, Gallivant, as well as Francesca Sesca Montoya in the BBC television series Waterloo Road, and Layla in the American action film The Scorpion King II, Rise of a Warrior. Captain Keeshing Clifford Nongram, Kargil War veteran is from this city. He was posthumously awarded Shorya Chakra for his heroics in the Kargil War. Leela Majumdar, the writer, spent her childhood days at Shillong, where she studied at Loreto Convent. Narad C. Chaudhary has written extensively about Shillong in his book The Autobiography of an Unknown Indian. Rabindranath Tagore, Nobel laureate, poet, author, thinker, artist, playwright, considered a patriarch of Bengali society, often sojourned in the cool climes of Shillong, besides living in a summer residence called Matali, today in use as a temporary state legislative assembly on loan from the State Art and Culture Department. A writing desk and chair used by the poet laureate can still be seen and used in the Maharaja suite of the Tripura Castle Heritage Hotel. Rono Dutta, president of United Airlines did his schooling from St. Edmund's School. Shillong Chamber Choir have performed in the World Choir Olympics and elsewhere in the world. They won the talent show India's Got Talent in 2010. Swami Vivekananda the 12th of January 1863 to the 4th of July 1902, born as Narendranath Dutta, was the chief disciple of the 19th century mystic Sri Sri Ramakrishna Paramahamsa and is the founder of Ramakrishna Mission headquartered at Bailur. He was primarily responsible for introducing Hindu philosophies of Vedanta and Yoga in the West and best known for his inspiring speech beginning with Sisters and Brothers of America. In his opening remark at the Parliament of the World's Religions at Chicago in 1893, the Swami delivered his last public lecture of his life in Shillong. The place of his last public lecture have been immortalized by erecting his statue at the very spot also known as Quinton Memorial, Vivekananda Cultural Center. Utpal Dutt, the prominent actor of Bengali and Hindi cinema, studied initially in St. Edmund's School before moving to St. Xavier's Collegiate School Kolkata. Victor Banerjee, an actor, was a student of St. Edmund's School. Verrier Elwin, celebrated British anthropologist and author, recipient of the Padma Bhushan, eventually settled in Shillong and lived in the town until his death in 1964. Robert De Silva, Pakistani Roman Catholic priest attended seminary in Shillong. Gallery See also Tourism in North East India <laughs>